I'm Gareth Ed Davis, boxing correspondent of the Daily Telegraph. I'm here at Wembley Stadium ahead of the massive clash between Tyson Fury and Dillian White for the WBC heavyweight title on Saturday night. 94,000 people, a record-breaking crowd will be in here. Tyson Fury defending that WBC heavyweight crown in his second reign, undefeated, of course, as heavyweight champion against Dillian White, the mandatory challenger. Fury, 33, is undefeated in 32 fights. He's been an outstanding champion. Dillian White, the mandatory challenger, 28 wins, two losses. He's waited over three years for this challenge. It's a monumental occasion, a massive fight between two British heavyweights. You have to go back to 1993 for an event of this magnitude when Frank Bruno and Lennox Lewis fought in Cardiff. Tyson Fury for me, yes, is the favorite on paper as well as with his skill set, but Dillian White is tenacious and aggressive, has a good jab, has very heavy left hooks and a right hand, but Tyson Fury can box on the back foot, the front foot, switch southpaw and orthodox. He's the complete heavyweight right now. He was a defensive fighter in the past, but has become more aggressive as his career has gone on, as we saw in the two last fights in the trilogy with Deontay Wilder in America. We are set for an amazing occasion here. St. George's Day, of course, on Saturday night. I'm picking Tyson Fury to win this in a dramatic contest. He may even have to go down in this fight and get up as we've seen him do against Deontay Wilder. But I'm picking Fury to eventually dismantle Dillian White, retain his belt and stop him around the ninth or 10th round. We are set for a special occasion at Wembley. Two British heavyweights, the WBC heavyweight title. It doesn't get bigger than this.